Good morning, good morning. I should probably fix my hair. Good morning. I'm singing here. People are texting too early in the morning. Tip of the morning to you. So exciting news for this week. I'm in an improv show, very different from stand-up. Stand-up is well thought through and prepared. Improv, anything could happen. I don't know if you guys remember a video I posted a while back about a single man, a show that I went to in which I married a guy accidentally on stage. We later went out on a date or two or really not many more than that. But anyways, this month the show is called A Single Lady in which they have a single lady get up on stage and tell her story. I actually used to sleep in this Walmart parking lot. And they act out her life and then they set her up with The Bachelor, and the rest is history-ish. Guess who the single lady is? That's right, so Saturday night, 9 p.m., Finest City Improv. And you can be darn sure I will shower for this occasion. If you wanna make it look like you showered, but you didn't, baby powder. You're just gonna dab some in your hand like so, get it together like you're an athlete, and go, go, go! So fresh. <laughs> Not to mention, if you're a single bachelor yourself, feel free to show up as a volunteer in the audience who could possibly play the dating game in which I will be the bachelor. Do you ever feel like sometimes it's stressful just being awake? I know. So many issues. So hard to resist. You know when you want a guy to text you back and he doesn't text you back? <laughs> I don't care. I'm the single lady. I'm the single lady. The thing to keep in mind with improv is that it has never happened before and it will never happen again. So this show you want to be at because it will literally be history in the making. Maybe not the most profound of history stories, but history nonetheless. Yeah.